Today I want to talk to you about setting wire feed speed settings the same from one machine to the other. Now this will only work comparing apples and apples, uh, oranges to oranges. So if, you're, uh, if you can know a setting, in other words, if you, if you weld with your machine and you determine that 250 inches a minute is a great wire feed speed setting, you can verify that and you can go to another machine that's running the same wire setup and the same gas setup and you can make it run just pretty much the same as your machine so you won't be just lost uh, as far as where to start. So the way to determine that wire feed speed setting is just like this. Hit the trigger, it counts six seconds. 1,001, 1,002, 1,003, 1,004, 1,005, 1,006. And then just measure what you got. I've got 24 inches. So round it up, if it's 23 and a half, round it up, add a zero. 240 inches a minute. Multiply it times 10 because we counted six seconds. So 240 inches a minute actually is a pretty good ballpark setting for 3 16 quarter inch steel. But if you go to another machine that's running 035 wire, the same as this, also running the same gas setup, 7525, that's going to get you really close uh, as a good starting point. Because you might go to another machine that might not even have a knob on the wire feed speed, or it might be totally different than the one you're accustomed to welding. It might have a no knob and a pair of vice grips clamped on it. Uh, it might have a low and a high range, so the settings are completely different than the machine you're accustomed to welding on. Again, you've got to have the same size wire, same gas setup, but it'll also work for a 115 volt big machine with 023 wire. If you determine you've got a setting that you like on your machine at home, and you can go ahead and do this little count off thing, uh, you can write that down, and then no matter where you are, if you're at your brother-in-law's house and he's got a 115 volt big, uh, 115 volt MIG uh, with 023 wire running the same setup you are, you can get it running just like just like you ran back home without having to look like a fool and not knowing what you're doing. So it's a good little trick. 